the Import Data from Applications feature and the Export Data to Applications feature are accessed from the CPS menu bar's File menu. The Export feature allows you to send out selected CPS CodePlug data, thus allowing for customized reporting capability in other software applications. Note that exporting uses the CSV file format. CSV is a text file format supported by applications such as Microsoft's Excel spreadsheet program. Note that before starting the import process, the CPS menu bars View, Options window, Import Options page allows you to customize the import data behavior to either append or overwrite existing CPS CodePlug data. Be aware that you may also customize which import statistics are saved to the import log file. These data statistics may include or exclude missing fields, read-only fields, truncated fields, and or inapplicable fields. The Import feature allows you to bring in CPS CodePlug data from other software applications. The file extension supported for importing data into the CPS is also CSV. Depending on the CSV file selected, choose the appropriate data to import. Then select the Import button. Once the import is complete, the data statistics are retrieved and conveniently listed within the Import Log File window. You may also view the import log file at any time from the CPS menu bar's Tools, Log File Selection. The Fill Value Up and Fill Value Down features can greatly enhance your data entry productivity. These features are available from within any CPS table type window, like the Phone Number window, or from any table type page, like the Astro Talk Group list. As an example, modify the top talk group alias to a desired value. And be sure to press Enter to exit the edit mode. Now, right-click on the still highlighted field and row, and then select To Fill Value Down. Now, modify only the numbers, saving many keystrokes. To try the Fill Value Up feature, First choose Secure Strapping for the bottom record. Now right-click on the still highlighted field and row, and then select To Fill Value Up. Once again, many data entry keystrokes have been avoided, saving even more data entry time. The Macro Record and Play feature is available from the CPS menu bars View, Toolbar, Macro Selection. This feature reduces programming time by allowing you to record repetitive data entry actions. Once recorded, these data entry actions can then be played back again and again in other code plugs. Dragging and dropping of conventional and trunking personalities to zones is also now possible. This productivity option offers another method for building zone and channel structure. Click on the green arrow icon of the appropriate personality and then drag it. And then drop it on the appropriate zone. This CPS feature is available at any time. The Zone Channel Assignment Wizard is accessed from the CPS menu bar's Tools menu and is only available when a code plug has not been previously modified. This feature allows you to easily create the required number of conventional channels and scan lists within the required number of zones. The Zone Channel Assignment Wizard walks you through this process. Once your zone channel and scan list structures are defined, you are then prompted to enter the necessary information for each channel within each zone. The Frequency Offset feature allows you to create several data entry shortcuts relating to receive frequency values. For instance, enabling the Zone Channel Assignment setting and then defining an offset value causes the Channels page 
transmit frequency setting to always differ by the same amount from the receive frequency setting of the same conventional personality. This feature is most useful when the frequency offset value is constant for several conventional personalities. The Frequency Pick Lists feature allows you to create data entry shortcuts relating to transmit and receive frequency field values. Once pick list frequency values are defined, These values can then easily be selected from several frequency fields throughout the CPS program. This ultimately reduces frequency entry time and entry errors by changing the frequency entry method from a type-it-in entry to a picklist style selection. The channel picklist feature is accessed from the CPS menu bar's tools menu. This feature can greatly enhance your data entry productivity by allowing you to export channels from the Channels page to the Pick List window for the eventual transfer to other code plugs. From the Channels page, click to highlight an individual channel to copy. Now right-click and then select Export to Channel Pick List or select to Export All to Channel Picklist. You may also delete any channel from the Picklist window. Once channels are in the Picklist, the Description field allows you to make individual notes for each channel. These notes remain available from within the Picklist. Now to reuse these copied channels, Close the current CPS code plug. Open a different code plug. And open the channels page. And then import the channels from the pick list. To import, first highlight the channel that is to be overwritten. Now right click to select import. The import channel window then appears. Select the appropriate channel and click OK to transfer the channel. The Save button allows you to archive the current picklist channels to a file. This archived file can then be retrieved at a later time from within the CPS's picklist or even from another CPS's picklist on another PC. The Load button allows you to open previously saved channel picklist files. And just as before, you can easily import channels from the picklist window into the current CPS code plug.